start with a statement about the game, please. Intense. Um, both sides battled really, really hard and, you know, fought for their lives and we were able to come on top. I think we we're only down the first the first goal of the game and then we were even or ahead, which is different than games of late, it seems. So um, that was good. Our girls fought hard. Give it to Northridge. They're a great team and they made it extremely tough for us. Can you talk a little bit about Paula? Um, four goals tonight. Incredible performance. What does she mean? What did she mean tonight? Yeah, she's got a lot of heart. Um, she wants to win, and um, she's an incredible player. She was a leader in the water tonight. You know, everyone was looking in her eyes. She was demanding. You know, on the defensive side, I'd say I'd commend her even more than the offensive side. I didn't even know she had four goals. <laughs> but um, but yeah, she's she's an incredible, and she steps up when when it matters. It's good to good to see tonight. When it matters most. Now you've played season a couple times this season, very close games. What was the advantage tonight, and what were the keys to the game? You know, they're a fast team and they're physical. They've got a you know a lot of seniors. They've got a great center, um, number six, a great player, and um, Kelsey Barrett. They've just they've just got a really well balanced team, and um, we wanted to get stops and counter, and you know that's kind of the name of our game. And we we had a lot of opportunities tonight. I think we could have put a few away, um, but it just it didn't work out that way and the game was tight. Um, the, the, last, the last six seconds brought back, you know, that's in our conference game, was in our house. We had just tied it. Um, six seconds left, timeout play, so our girls wanted that one really bad. <laughs> Get it back. And um, Coach Arroyo actually, he told, just told us that they ran the same play that they ran in the conference game. Were you expecting that play at the very end? Uh, yes, you know, with t that much time, it's it's tough for the referees because there's a ton of grabbing and you know let a lot of stuff go, and it's just you gotta stay with your player and try not let them get the their hand on the ball, and they're able to get free. And um, I don't know if it was that one or the one before. Uh, our goalie came up with a huge save in the last couple possessions there, so that was that was huge for us. I'm looking forward to tomorrow's game. Um, you don't have a lot of time to celebrate the victory, but how do you like motivate the players to keep going after this type of win? Um, you're playing for a championship. I think, you know, I always say championships kind of take care of themselves. This is, it's really hard to get there, and of course it's hard to win a championship, but I don't think any team ever has a hard time getting up for a championship. I think they're, they'll be ready to go. It doesn't matter fatigue or anything at this point. It's, it's all heart, and, and, and they want to they wanna do well. Um, seemed like a very physical match, and I saw that you got a yellow card um, in the fourth. Was that because you were pointing out the type of plays of referees, or was it on a separate incident? Yeah, you know, um, there is a lot of grabbing. It was an extra physical game, and I think a couple of their goals, they, they got free because our girl couldn't just get to them because of the holding. So, and when that happens, I want to make the refs aware, and, um, and I was reprimanded for that. <laughs> okay. All right. Thanks, Coach. Appreciate Thank it. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you.